Hey, welcome to Level Up. I'm Martina and today I'm going to show you how to animate the marker to create a highlight in your text. Okay, let's start. First thing that we need to have is a marker. You can find a link in the description below if you want to download the same one and practice with me. The next thing that we need is the highlight. In Office 2016, there's a new tab called Draw and here you can find a lot of pens and highlights that you can use to draw a shape on your slide. However, if it's not visible, let's right click on the ribbon and select Customize Ribbon. Then on the right side of this panel, make sure the box close to the word Draw is checked and click OK. Great, let's take a look what's inside. Here in a pens group, you can find a highlighter. Click on it and then automatically you're in the drawing mode. So just click and drag to create a highlight on the slide. To get out from that mode, press escape on your keyboard. Let's try to animate it. Go to the animation tab and click Y. Unfortunately, something is not right. You saw that black bar prior to animation. We have to get rid of it. How to do it? Let's cut out this highlight and then we're going to paste it special. You can use a shortcut, Ctrl Alt V and select PNG format. I will just move it on top of the text and right click to send it to the back. Let's try to apply animation again and let's see what's going to happen. Wipe. Great. What if you have Office 2010 and you don't have that option? Don't worry. I will show you another way to create this highlight. I will delete this one, then go to the Home tab and here you will find Freeform. If it's not visible here, click the More button. And in the lines group, select the second from the end option, Freeform. Now you're again in the drawing mode. Click to create a point, then move mouse and click again to form something in the shape of a highlight. When you click on the first point you created, that will close the path and form that shape. If you can't close the path manually, just hit escape on your keyboard. Now let's change the shape fill to this bright yellow in standard colors and shape outline to no outline. Time to apply the animation. Go to the animation tab, select wipe and change effect options to from left. Great. Right click on it and let's send it to back so it will be behind the text. Time to animate the marker. Place it at the beginning of our highlight and then in the animation tab select fly in. Change effect options to from top. We also have to add some motion path, but to add additional animation, click add animation button, scroll down till you see motion paths and select line. Again, we have to change the effect options to go to the right. Now let's adjust the end point of the animation. Hold shift on your keyboard and click and drag to place the marker at the end of our highlight. To see all animations that we applied, click on the animation pane. Here, the first one belongs to the highlight. I want to place it at the end of our list, so I press this down arrow twice. The first animation is when our marker flies in, and I want to keep it to start on click. The second one, when he moves to the right, I want it to start automatically after previous. Let's also adjust the delay to 0.25 so then we'll have a small gap between flying in and moving to the right. And I want it to move faster so I would change the duration to 1.5. The last one belongs to the highlight and I'll change it to start with previous so then the pen will be moving in the same time when highlight will appear and I will just change the duration to match the duration of the animation of the marker. Great, let's see how it looks. Pretty well, but the marker and highlight, they're not well synchronized. And also I think it's just a little bit too long. Let's adjust it. First thing we could do is to change some effect options. Right click, select effect options. And here we have smooth start and smooth end that is not available in highlight animation. So we have to change it to zero. Click OK. Now let's see again the result. It's almost ready. I think the marker should go a little bit faster than the highlight. So I will select it and change the duration to 1.35. Let's see how it works right now. 
perfect. Now everything works well together. If you want to make it shorter or longer, all you have to do is adjust the duration. Of course, that could be just a starting point. To have more highlights on your slide, just keep adding those motion paths and wipe animations. That's all for today, but if you like our videos, subscribe to our channel and see you next week.